Welcome to the Life Touch Yearbook Training Series. In this episode, you'll learn how to edit a subject record. A subject refers to a student or staff member in your school, and their subject record is the information related to that person, such as photos, groups, and their nickname. From the dashboard, let's hover over Manage Images and select Portrait Images. I can locate a subject by finding them in one of our portrait groups, or I can search for a subject by name by clicking Search Subject. I'd like to pull up a record for Carter Birding, so I'm going to type Carter and then hit enter. And here he is. We'll click on his name to open his subject record. Starting from the top, we see Carter's official name as listed in the record provided by our school. We also have the option to use a nickname. It looks like our school had Carter's name in all caps, so by selecting Use a Nickname instead, we can change how his name is printed in the yearbook. This can also, of course, be useful when a student goes by a different name than what's listed in their school's record, such as someone named Jonathan going by John. You'll want to update the subject's yearbook nickname before flowing their portraits, since changes we make here won't be reflected in portraits that have already been flowed. However, if we do need to make a change to the name after flowing, we can just unflow and reflow the portraits. Here, we can select if this subject is student or staff. And then here is where we see and select the subject's portrait. If Carter had a retake, his replacement image would be shown here. Down at the bottom, we have the subject's group affiliation. So here we see that Carter is a member of the patrol captains. He's in Andrew Pike's class. He's a member of the FFA. And he's part of the second grade. We can remove Carter from any of these groups by clicking Remove. And we can add him to additional groups by selecting a group from the dropdown. Let's add him to the Model UN group by selecting Model UN and then clicking Add. We'll save our changes by clicking Save. And that's how to edit a subject record. For more info on working with subjects in portrait groups, including how to create a new subject record, check out our other episodes. Happy yearbooking!